So there's a big C right here of zigzagging flashing lights. I have not had an ocular migraine um, in two months. However, this last week, I've been enjoying Blue Bunny no sugar added stuff because I've been completely sugar free, haven't had any problems. Um, however, I've been doing dairy even though it's sugar-free, all of a sudden now I get this horrible zigzagging ocular migraine, which I haven't had in two months. So is it because of the dairy in the ice cream or is it something else? I mean, I, I hate that uh, well, I mean, since I've been on this keto diet, I haven't had any sugar, high fat, low carb, zero sugar. Um, this entire year, I think I've gone almost this entire year without any ocular migraine because I've been off of sugar. But I've also been on the keto diet, which means, you know, no uh, dairy, no milk, no, no, no dairy. So no milk, no milk, basically no milk. And now that I saw this blue bunny, I hate this because it's, it's zigzagging. It's like all the way over here. I could tell that it was going to happen too because they're like a big blind spot uh, that it was just blind. It was hard. I mean, it's just off to the side, you know, it's like you see four, but all of a sudden there's this blind spot. And within 20 minutes or so, all of a sudden now it's like this, it was, it was a bright flashy light stuff. And now it's like getting bigger and bigger and it's about the size of, of from here and it's going all the way around here now so I, I, it's, I hate this but the only thing different that I have been doing is dairy like milk milk products you know like ice cream and uh, even glasses of milk and stuff like that and I thought that I had the sugar thing under control because I didn't do the sugar thing and I thought that was it and then the only thing different I put in my back into my diet was milk. And now I'm having ocular migraines. So even though I, I love ice cream, now that I can actually associate ice cream, a glass of milk with these ocular migraines, now I'm going to completely stop milk altogether. I'm, I'm still going to do eggs, you know, uh, still do cheese, but just leave milk out of the equation completely. I'm even thinking about not doing heavy whipping cream either, um, since that's so closely related to milk, because on the keto diet you can have uh, heavy whipping cream. But I think I'm going to leave heavy whipping cream, milk, ice cream completely out of the equation and see if I can go a year without having well forever without having a, uh, another one of these ocular migraines because uh, when it gets this big which it's pretty much here it is um, it's going to be out of my field of vision here in probably in the next five minutes and when that happens boom massive pain I mean right now I don't have the massive pain it's just I feel awkward I feel like I'm you know what? It feels like I'm having electrical electricity just sent through my brain, which may be what the ocular migraine is because I feel like I can't focus and speak as confident and pull out the words that I want to pull out. And it kind of looks like electricity that that's stemming out from, from here anyway. And um, when it's all done, when, it's, when, when my brain is completely fried all the way around past my field of vision, then all of a sudden, boom, boom, massive, horrible headache. And I should have taken something uh, before. I, usually I take something, and then after the migraine, it's like I, I don't really feel any pain, but I forgot. Darn it. And it's almost over and done with. I usually take um, one of my prescription medicines. Um, that, that help with pain. Um, if I don't have that, it seems like uh, BC powder. BC powder really works great. Um, I get the cherry 
and uh, that usually takes care of these uh, the, the headache afterwards. Um, since I'm going to have to drive this afternoon and to go some places, I can't take my prescription medicine. So I'm going to take a BC Cherry Powder BC and uh, take that. Wow. I could really, it just almost feels like it's completely covering my face when I stand up when I was laying down. It wasn't that bad. But uh, yeah, I'm going to take some BC powder, um, the cherry flavor. I can actually choke that down. It's like no problem. That BC powder without the flavor, it's not that good. So anyways, yeah, I take this um, BC cherry, um, get it at Walmart. I think you can get on Amazon too, I'm not sure. But yeah, I'm going to take some of this. Uh, this headache is going to pop up here in just a minute. So maybe some coffee. With, oh yeah, black coffee. Yeah, this is crazy. I tried this before too because I didn't have anything else. Cherry, black coffee together. Actually, the flavor is quite delicious. Um, like a cherry, cherry cop. <laughs> I swallow this powder before I start to talk. I start to choke. Dogs don't know what the hell is going on. It's like, what's going on? You were just having fun playing with us. I know, right? Crazy. Actually, I kind of noticed it today. Went outside to, to do some cooking and the, the sun was really, I mean, the brightness was really bad, so I grabbed my glasses, and I was wearing my glasses out um, uh, while cooking on the grill, and I don't do this. I, the sun usually doesn't bother me, but today was like, it was really bothering me. Everything was just um, bad. Matter of fact, there's a couple of glares that happened too. It's like I was opening up the, uh, the grill, and it was like really a flash. Um, I took a picture, and of course, a glare off my, my um, phone, flashed into my eyes too and that hurt so that's when I decided to put on sunglasses so maybe there's a combination of the flashes of the sun the reflecting off the grill and uh, the phone and milk I don't know there's like no definitive answer about these ocular migraines uh, leave me some comments down below I don't want to take up too much more of your time it's almost been eight minutes but leave me some comments down below let me know what you think. Wow, there's just just this right here coming in is, is, is hurting me. Leave me some comments down below. Let me know what you think causes your ocular migraines. What has triggered this for you? If, if this is the first time that you've had an ocular migraine, what happened? Why are you watching this video with this ocular migraine where you thought that you're probably having... You know whatever I've heard so many things but let me know what you think because I don't know I'm gonna stay off of dairy and stay on my ketogenics diet see if that helps and uh, hopefully I won't be back here again telling you about an ocular migraine that I've had hmm thank you subscribe if you haven't and hopefully we'll see you without a migraine very soon